I want to share with you my new favorite Christmas story called The Christmas Book Flood. This book was written by Emily Kilmore, Kilgore, and illustrated by Kitty Moss. Illustrations are my favorite part. Darkness blankets the land, covering forests and homes, mountains and bookshops. Overhead, northern lights dance and curtsy across a cold black sky. Families snuggle in their homes, sprinkling the autumn terrain with pockets of warmth. Soon, snow will fly as the book flood draws closer. On the 24th of December, people gift books as a sign of love, of hope, during a dark time of year. Reading is magic when you have the right book. So, people plan and they dream and they sneak and they search for books to give loved ones and families and friends. With jittery wonder, they scan over covers and circle their favorites. It is almost time. So many new books, it's so hard to choose. Stories to get lost in, to laugh at, to share. Big books, small ones, thick and thin. New tales, old histories, fantastic and true. People face winter's bite and rush to the store under street lamps that show off the twirling snowflakes. There's laughter and hope and holiday cheer, bright twinkling lights, hot cocoa, soft music, clouds of warm breath, tight hugs of hello, the soft crunch under boots as they trudge through fresh snow. The strong smell of books unfurls at the door, a gush of excitement, just hours remain. Shoppers glide through the aisles of towering shelves. They whisper and giggle and bubble with glee. A clock chimes nearby. It's time to head home. But then at long last, a surge of relief. Could it be that one there? Tucked just out of sight? Yes, that magical book to bring loved ones joy. Clutching bags closely, their thrill overflowing. People hurry and scurry through carols and bells and rush the books home, wrap them as gifts, and wait. Then, finally, finally, it's finally time. Families gather together, love billows and swells. They pull back the tape, untangle the ribbons. Then pour over treasures and marvel together new worlds and adventures. Etched across pages, bound between covers. As stars glitter above and light fills the room, now it is time for the best part of all. With blankets and pillows, loved ones and warmth, they sip their hot chocolate and read, 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 read. The book flood spreads. The end. That sounds like a magical Christmas Eve to me. Hope you guys have a wonderful holiday.